Hey you guys, Chris here. Well, I took the Stan FPV motors off of clearance quad. So I've got that all cleared off and uh, ready for some new motors. Hopefully they'll be in in a couple of days. But until then, I put the Stan FPV motors, the 2604 1690 KV on my toothpick seven inch quad here. And uh, we're gonna run them on the new Gemfan 7035s. And these are cinematic props. I've done a special on them before. And uh, yeah, they're pretty good. Um, they're pretty stable. And I think with these cinematic motors, it's going to be a pretty good combination for, you know, something like this. This is not a GoPro hauling drone or anything. Uh, but I had a couple of subscribers ask me for a quick video with these Stan FPV motors with a seven inch prop. So I wanted to put these on a seven inch anyway. So here we are. So let's see how much this guy weighs. Basically I had to get some thinner wire because this thing came with 16 gauge wire, it was 20 centimeters long. So I put this 18 gauge wire on there and uh, it just helped a little bit, cut a couple of grams. These are 28 gram motors, so. All right, let's see how much trimming of the fat we have to do with this battery. So not too much. I think we're good. Sure, that'll be fine. All right, let's go for a quick hover and a flight. How are you doing, guys? All right, so. As I mentioned before, this is the Stan FPV 2604 1690 KV. These are the Gemfan 7035 cinematic uh, propellers. So I thought I'd pair them up with these cinematic motors. I'm gonna hover it right here for you so you can get an idea of just how quiet this is. Tell me if you can hear it over the sound of these crickets. flying this as a sub 250G right now. Okay, let's go, let me know how far you can hear it. Right there, that's as far as I can hear it. I can't hear it anymore. So I'm gonna measure that spot out. How far did I get before you could hear it? Pretty stealthy. All right, let's go for a flight. So I've got two flights here for you. This first one was right after that hover and sound test. And basically I'm just doing a quick little cinematic run, trying to see how steady, how smooth it is. And this was without a tune. The next flight is with a tune. Uh, after I saw the footage, I didn't like how much bobble there was. I didn't like uh, how basically unstable the quad was and it's not the worst I've ever flown trust me but if you're talking about cinematic motors and cinematic props this is unacceptable so I wanted to give it a real shot so I went ahead and did another flight so this is bone stock filters bone stock PIDs and I didn't add the JESC software to the ESCs so this is just the uh, what BL Heli S software. So that's what you got here. Not great. And the next flight will make up for that. So this flight was after I think my third iteration of tuning. Uh, I went into the black box. I got all the filters right. And now I'm messing around with the PIDs. And there's still a little bit of vibration there uh, when I hit the throttle. So I might tweak that one more time. But in the end, I was just trying to see if these Stan FPV motors would be able to handle a 7-inch prop, and they definitely do. If you want me to test something, let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to like and subscribe.